Ne touchons pas nos malades, ne touchons pas nos mourants. Tout le monde est en danger, les jeunes et les anciens. Il faut agir pour nos familles. My name is Anne Driscoll. I was deployed in Liberia in a rural county called Bomi County. Um, actually, all the counties outside of Monrovia are rural. Um, and I was paired with another CDC colleague from Atlanta, and I was epidemiologist on the team. Our overall goal was to work with the county health team um, and our other partners, particularly WHO and a number of other NGOs there, both Liberian and international um, NGOs, to do whatever we could to enhance the the um, the overall the overall um, the overall effort, anything from case met or um, case finding to contact tracing to safe burials. You spend a couple your first couple of weeks getting to know the people and their roles and their relationships with each other and um, the local politics, the local culture. Um, so just as you're starting to feel like you've got a grasp of things, you're, you're in exit mode a little bit. So that was tough. We did a lot of traveling into the little villages, which means the county we were in had one paved road. And once you up that, went up that paved road, it was mud, basically mud tracks. And so you, you needed a, an SUV to get through there or a motorbike, which CDC does not allow us to um, use. So we were paired up with two Peace Corps volunteers who were from the area who spoke the local language. There's English, but there's also a bunch of different local languages, um, and they were our eyes and ears um, into what was going on. They were the ones who could talk to people that we couldn't. Because, um, maybe it was a language barrier, maybe it was a, a, just a trust issue. Um, they were also our ride. Uh, we went everywhere in a Peace Corps SUV, <laughs> and the Peace Corps is very well respected and, and loved there. So when you show, show up in a, in a, in a um, in a vehicle in a little village with a Peace Corps decal on your truck, um, people are more likely to be happy to see you and to work with you. So that they, they were great. As we talked to a number of the local chiefs, each village had a chief who you went through to talk to um, before you talked to anyone else in the village. And a lot of them were really um, very, very adamant about that they wanted to work with people, they wanted to protect their village, their, their own people, um, and they went a long ways, and I think they had come a long way from earlier on before we even got there in terms of understanding and deciding to work with um, the, the county health team and with other health teams to, to um, change their attitudes from one of fear or fear or just you know shutting people out to inviting in help and, and using it the best way they, that they could for their own people. So that was Je suis un docteur